Oh, uh, all deep, bring these flowers. Okay, this ass is a bitch. Ass right here, oh, King, this ass is a goofy, bro. What is wrong with you, bro? Don't bring none what is wrong with you, bro? Yo, that ass is a goofy on all gray. Lame ass nigga on O. Yo, ass a bitch on King Dave. Motherfucker gonna catch your lame ass. That shit was 6 9 that shit ain't cool. Oh, no, they got this man running around. It's funny and shit. It's funny. Yeah, that shit funny as shit. That shit ain't funny, gang. It's man. Cause it's like this. I don't know the nigga, gang. I don't give no fuck about the nigga 6 9 I don't know. But he told them all type of people, gang, and they, and they people locked up and shit, and, and, and people family members and shit. And people gotta take care of them people, and them people got kids, and them people, you know. You know, it's like he done told them, after heard he told them a lot of people, like, so. I know it's people, like, he probably ain't did shit to him. And he told on them and shit, like, you know. For them, they thought it, like, there's some people, I know everybody ain't did nothing to 6 9 you see what I'm saying? So whoever did, do whoever did, cause y'all be saying, alright, they fucked this baby mama. Ooh, alright, that's one nigga, gang. Okay, they heard that nigga told him all type of niggas. See, yeah, that don't even justify either. Man, niggas fucking this baby mama said all oh, day, day. That shit don't. That shit don't. Nah, that shit ain't it. That's what about them other people? Like, like, I, I, I. He did that. He did that. Well, damn, now like, who gonna take care of the kids? Oh, all right, shitty boy. All right, shitty boy. Okay, shitty boy. What that is? So King Von is back in the news i'm shaking my head guys how bad does your cloud addiction gotta be if you need to diss somebody's loved ones who passed away and you don't even know them you're just doing it for the clout shaking my head and for the people commenting oh it's 2 p.m on old block nothing happened bruh the shyrak savages of 2012 2013 grew up took their talents to the lakers they're living in la now i think even rico reckless moved out but let's not get off track. So, ladies and gentlemen, breaking news on this fine Saturday. 6ix9ine just crossed the line. Last time, one of my favorite artists crossed the line with Dirk. He unfortunately didn't make it. His name was Lil Jojo. I'm sure you guys already know. Jojo was beefing with Chief Keef and Dirk. He dropped the track 300k. Some people said it was taking it too far. Couple months after that, Lil Jojo was gunned down. Dirk dropped the famous line, claim 300. Add a K, you're done. Now years later 6ix9ine just crossed the line with Dirk and lord knows what's gonna happen 6ix9ine posted a short clip on his IG acting like he's paying respects to Lil Dirk's cousin OTF Nunu OTF Nooski who was killed in 2014 in the video 6ix9ine puts flowers outside O Block buildings with the caption came to O Block to pay my respects to Lil Dirk's cousin Nooski who was killed by gun violence few hours later some of Chirac's savages converged on the scene but only found the flowers 6ix9ine was nowhere to be found saw the video and decided to address the situation he said this shit with 6ix9ine is not cool they got this man running around thinking it's funny this shit is not funny i agree with king von what 6ix9ine did was not funny bringing lil dirk's dead cousin into the beef that's just not cool you cannot do that that's why lil dirk hasn't responded Hopefully somebody talks some sense into 6ix9ine because clearly he's doing too much. Bro needs to settle down. I'll keep you guys updated if there's any developments. Thank you so much for tuning in. You're a boy, Alfred out. I just wanna get that money.